Awesome. I'm here with our amazing client, Ty Lynn. She is finishing 12 months with the Precision Lifestyle, and she's here to share her experience. Ty Lynn, go ahead and share with us a little bit about yourself. How old are you? What do you do? Married, kids, all that. Tell us a little bit about your background. Okay. I'm uh, 63 years old. I've been married uh, to my husband for 43 years. We met in high school. And uh, of course, not the same high schools, and we've been together ever since. Um, I uh, am a certified registered nurse anesthetist. I've been doing that for about 27 years. Uh, before that, I, in that time period, I was a martial arts instructor for about 30 years. And, um, you know, just about when I was, I'm 63, I, I think around 40 years old, I was in a car accident and got hurt my back. I was always fit before then, but when I got hurt, I was taking a lot of steroid injections. I gained weight. I couldn't work out because I was always in pain. And then, um, it just spiraled from there. It, I had to shut my martial arts school down because I couldn't do a lot of things. And, uh, I just over the next 10, I just st stacked on weight all the way up to 215 pounds. And I just kind of was stuck there for a long time. I had two total hips, I had a cervical fusion. And I just felt like with everything, every time something like that happened, it kind of set me back. And I never really got back into any kind of fitness shape again. And uh, then I was just kind of stuck. You know, I probably had a time where I could have gotten back in shape, but I just couldn't do it. I didn't know what the obstacle was. I had at 50 years old, this all started happening. And, um, I just stacked on the weight from there and it just never came off. And every time I tried on my own, even though I had years and years of experience on what I should be doing, I just couldn't get through and do it. And I got desperate and I, I, uh, had worked out with, um, twice bitten, uh, in, you know, when I was in Oklahoma city and that's where I met Rob and you Trammy. And, um, during that time, that was before my first total hit. That was before, before my second total hit, I lost down to 179, uh, 179 pounds on that six weeks program. Well, it really took me 10 months. <laughs> I, I signed up and stayed, but it happened because um, I had a coach, I had people that cared and I was working hard, you know, and once I did it and had the hip replacement, I actually uh, moved from Oklahoma city to Myrtle beach. And it just stacked all back on again, you know, and I just couldn't just didn't believe get it done on my own. I tried, you know, I thought I had the tools and I tried, it just wasn't happening. And I saw your ad for precision lifestyle. And I saw how fit you were in, even though you were fit at twice bitten, this was different. You were cut in, you looked great. And I was like, well, I know them. I know Rob and Trammy. I know how they worked hard at that at Twice Bitten. And I think I want to be a part of that. And I called, I called. And that's how I got involved with Preci Precision Lifestyle. So proud of you. Desperate mode. Got it. And tell me a little bit about your specific results. I know you lost 25 pounds total about, and yeah. you, in inches, you lost about 15 inches around your waist, your hips, your stomach, your thighs, your arms, biceps, chest, things like that. Like, tell me yeah. about, tell me about that. Tell me about your results that you're proud of, the specific results you got. Well, I, you know, I, um, started out in the program, we got started and, um, I think, you know, I had some frustration in the beginning. I remember being on one of the zoom calls with other people and just breaking down and crying because I was like, why isn't this happening for me? Because, you know, I think I wanted it really quick, quicker, you know, it wasn't happening quick. And I was like, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. And I was so scared, you know, that, um, it wasn't going to happen. And through the program, the coaches were able, or always positive, always upbeat, nothing happens fast. It shouldn't happen fast because, um, it doesn't last. I mean, it happens for all kinds of people that lose a lot of weight and they look really great. And then they get off whatever health fad they were on and they gain it all back and more. And that's happened to me too, but this was different. It was coming off really slow. 
and it comes off in a kind of a up, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, down fashion until it kind of, you see over time, it steadily comes down. And it took a while for me to see that pattern and coaches to encourage me that everything was going just the way it ought to be, that there was no such thing as bad foods was a big uh, tool that was given to me. There's just better foods, better choices. You know, there's not a bad food out there. You just can eat the things that you really love that are not the greatest for you in moderation. But if you stick to a nice nutritional diet, not diet, but um, food choices, because even the foods, what I've learned is the foods that you think are healthy foods, they taste good too. You know, if they're cooked with herbs and spices and, you know, in the right way, they taste good too. You just have to learn how to cook or how to do those recipes. That's what I've learned. I've learned that, um, uh, you know, that 1% better every day, you know, just, just worry about getting 1% better every day. It's still a slow process, 1%. But what it taught me was just settle back and understand that this is not going to happen fast. It's better if it happens slow and that it will stay off. And, 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 and exactly that's what's been happening. It's been a process and, and I steadily lost weight and it's been an up and down fashion and it's been uh, the coaching has helped me understand that that's okay and things are going to work out for you just plug away at the what we're teaching you and then um, another thing I learned was to plan ahead you know the program taught me to plan ahead and you know it's it's like it's work but if you will put it into your life as a habit it becomes easier and easier and I learned that um, if I could, if I could plan for the week, and I could plan for travel, if I could plan for going to a restaurant ahead of it, I was, I would make the right choices while I was there, and that's happened. And so that's been good. Those are tools I've been given through this program. And uh, over, and you hear it from other people, but you have to be doing it, you know. And you, you the coaches really encourage you and help you. And uh, the coaches never talk they're never, they're never negative. There's no, oh, you shouldn't have done that. It's like, well, what do you think? You know, was there, did you think that was something that you could do different? What would you do different next time? Do you think it was really that bad? Is it okay to have something that you love now and then, as long as you're staying on the program, all those things help me so much. Um, and then the breakthrough session, the breakthrough session was a big deal. I mean, it happened at six months and it was like, you know, why did I just stack this weight on at 50 years old? And I had all these disciplines, you know, all this discipline in my past for over 30 years. Why can't I take this weight off? What is wrong with me that I cannot get back into that discipline mode? And um, through the breakout session with Trammy, I learned that, and this will make me cry, but I learned that maybe. I just didn't value myself um, or didn't see that my husband might value me if I gained all this weight because my grandfather left my grandmother when she was 50. My dad left my mother when she was 50. And um, it was like, you know, once they get, got some age on them or any kind of weight on them, or if they weren't the, what, you know, young and vivacious like they were, they just dumped them like they were nothing, you know? And I saw it over and over. My dad was married four times and every wife was younger. And so those were my examples. And uh, <laughs> Trammy's like, well, maybe you're, I was testing my husband, you know, maybe I was testing to see if he'd leave me because I was overweight, you know, and he just um, has stuck by my side through this whole thing. He's been doing the prep for my meals. He's been doing the cooking at night. He, I don't have to worry about a lot of the prepping because he does all of it for me. He's at the first, there was resistance for him to eat the foods I was eating, which was hard for me, but it turned out that he found out that he loves these foods too. They taste good. He's cooking them. They're nutritious. They taste good. And he's loving them now too. We're eating the same foods with this. In fact, we're running the 5k together tomorrow. So, so much has changed. I mean, he's told me that um, he was going to have to sabotage my diet because I might leave him. <laughs> you know? so good. I know. Right. And then, uh, he, uh, and he was just teasing, you know, but he, uh, um, 
told me he was he's been very um complimentary and he's told me when I lost my you know he says oh those lumps on your back are gone you know because I get fat on my back he goes those lumps are gone Ty <laughs> you know and just all kinds of amazing things from um reinforcement from my husband you know which has been great so it's been a slow progress but I think it's the best way to do it there's no fast fixes and um, I think I know it will stick. I know it will. I have the tools, you know, I've learned a lot in this year and I believe that um, it's gonna serve me for the rest of my life. We're so proud of you. Not only have you worked on the foundation of your body, but you've also worked on your mind, your self-confidence, your self-worth, and now your relationships are improved because of it. And how about your, the area of your career? What breakthroughs did you get there? Well, I, uh, you know, I wasn't speaking up at work. Um, I was, um, you know, I, was, I think I was being pushed around a little bit by my, uh, uh, the nurse and the administrator of the facility. I am the anesthesia provider there. I, there's only two of us. Nobody really knows what we do. And they were trying to tell us how to do our job or what we could do or we couldn't do. And just through coaching some coaching I was able to recognize that um, I needed just project confidence that I am the anesthesia provider I am the one with the knowledge it's you know I mean I just finally just said look I nobody knows how to do anesthesia here except for Matt and I and we're the ones that are the experts and we're gonna do what we think is right period dot and it just happened through a break, you know, part of the breakthrough session and it changed everything at my job. I mean, I, I was being called in her office left and right because the nurses didn't like this. They didn't like that. But that doesn't happen. It hasn't happened since, you know, I mean, it's just like, you know, she trusts what I say. She recognizes that that's the truth. I'm the one that knows what I'm doing. Nobody else does. And nobody should be telling me how to do anesthesia when they don't even know what. No, I'm the expert. So, that is so amazing. Not only are you more confident with your body, but in your relationships. And now the confidence has spilled into the area of your career. And now you are more confident in your abilities and others in the field are recognizing your greatness as well. Just because you filled your cup first. Yes. Well, and, and talking about a little bit about that, you know, I, you know, when I first started the program, it's this kind of a different subject, but I hurt all over my body. I hurt in all my joints. It was hard for me. I couldn't get off the floor when I started without going to the couch and pulling myself up. I could not, I had pain in every joint. Um, I was, you know, it hurt. I'd have to get up and get going through the day and through the nutrition, um, it has changed everything because I've learned about anti-inflammatory foods or good flu foods that, um, you know, benefit my body. And I don't have joint pain. I don't have it anymore. I don't get up in the morning hurting. I don't have a pain in my knees, my hips, my back. I've done so many squats. I can get off the, I could get off the floor, yeah. <laughs> you know? So, um, and the squats are great, you know, for strength to get just off the couch, get off the floor, get off the toilet. <laughs> uh, very practical, very functional everyday fitness, right? Yes. Yeah. So it's been great. I mean, I am in way better shape. I'm, you know, tomorrow I'm running a 5k, you know, I haven't ran a 5k in over probably, I don't know, 20 years. So uh, I can do it. I've been walking. I've been walking three miles, so I can do 3.2, no problem. So I just don't see it as a, even a bump in the road tomorrow. Right. Husband is doing it with me. He hasn't done it in 20 years neither. So. Wow. So not only are you pioneering your health and fitness, but you're leading by example, strengthening you and your husband's relationship. And now he's following suit too. He is stepping up and living that fit lifestyle with you. That is so amazing. He's always been fit, you know, as far as he works out three days, you know, three, four days a week at the gym, but this is new for him for sure. Wow. I love it. I did for me to be a part of his workout at the gym and you know now he's going to run with me and I think this year we are getting bikes and we're going to be biking and we have kayaks we're going to be kayaking 
and um, we'll definitely continue to walk and maybe enter. Um, we're talking about next year entering the other part of this, which is the, I mean, we'll train for it, but it's the half marathon. Ooh. That's the goal for next year. I love it. I remember at the very beginning, you and your husband love to go and do social things, right? Yes. But around the social things, it may not be active. However, right. now what I'm hearing is you guys are kayaking together, doing 5Ks together, about to sign up next year for a half marathon together. So you're doing activities that are just more fit and in movement, celebrating your bodies. It is. And we don't eat out as much. We eat at home more. I mm -hmm. mean, the food is better at home. So there you go. The, the refrigerator has changed. The cabinets have changed. There's the foods are not the same as when I started, you know, they're full of good, healthy choices, options to just go in and make something up. We've got little recipes that are fast to make that are healthy, where it's a, it's a habit now. It has been an amazing program. It has. Amazing. Is there anything else that you want to mention? You know, I had a picture. I can't pull it up. It's on my phone. I tried to find it, but it's the picture of me in that dress that kind of set me off, you know, and uh, I was going to take another picture. I haven't done it in my new dress, but I haven't Ooh. done it, you know, to show the comparison. And I can still upload that to you, Trammy. Yeah. but the, uh, the dress that I was in and the dress I'll be in, I mean, it's just so much I mean, we just pulled it up right before I called you because um, I wanted to try to get it uploaded where I could show you, but, and it's on my phone. I really don't know how to do a Zoom call and get it up to you. You know what I mean? I'll, sh I'll show you after this video, I'll show you how to send it to me and I'll, I'll just put them together so we can look at them. Right, right. And then I'll take the other picture and I'll send them to you so that you can see the huge, huge difference. So, yes. Amazing. Yes. Awesome. So you've crushed it in. Oh, so just out of curiosity, what would you say to someone who might be on the fence about starting our program? Um, you know, it is, it is, it is hard when you're, when you get to a certain stage and you're, you're, you're so you know, you're finally making the decision. You really need help to do something to get you started in the correct direction. There's so many bad habits you have now that, you know, the Precision Lifestyle Program will put you on the right track. They will give you the coaches that you need, the support that you need, the education that you need, and it is worth every single penny that you pay. It is worth it. There is no doubt about it. Um, I would just say that um, I'm, thank I'm thankful that I started the program. Uh, I wouldn't be where I am right now without it. And I feel like I have gotten the education and the tools I need to maintain my, to, I have a different lifestyle going on. And I think I can main, I believe, I know I can maintain that um, for the rest of my life. I know I can, you know, I just, I, I do believe that coaches are needed, you know, uh, somebody to be accountable to, especially when you are in such, um, uh, yeah. there's so many things, like even now on the Zoom programs, I listen to the people that are starting the program and they have, they sound like I sounded when I started, you know what I mean? They have so many reasons why they can't do something, you know, and I listen to it and I'm like, yeah, they're going to get you. <laughs> they're <laughs> they're going to show you, 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 you got amazing results coming. You just have to stick it, stick it, stick it, stick with it, you know? So yeah. thank you yeah. so much, Tywin. You've crushed it in the past 12 months. We are super excited to see you continuing to keep growing and getting better from here. Yes.